really hope this isn't way too bright. Also, I just got out of the shower, so please excuse the wet mop look. I usually don't wash my hair if I shower in the morning, but I hadn't washed it in a couple days and it was deeply needed, so just bear with this. why it was off topic let's try this again but i just finished my workout and stuff i'm not gonna lie i only did half of the workout that was a 20 minute hit workout on the lemon's workout page because i did like the like the leg and the lower body half the other day and my legs still kind of hurt so i think i did like the lower body circuit one time and then i did all three of the upper body circuits not sure if my skincare routine is perfect i'm not a professional i'm just a teen trying to battle acne but you guys asked for it, so I feel like I should throw it in this video. So in the shower, I washed my face with the Curology Cleanser. I think I mentioned this part in my quarantine morning routine, but if you haven't seen that video, which you should watch, link in the eye, I will mention it again. I used the Curology Cleanser in the shower, and now I'm using the Curology Moisturizer. This is not sponsored, I just like Curology. And then I'm going to, oh, this feels, it's so cold. This feels so good. I apologize if this is kind of all over the place right now. I don't know if I'm even rolling it right. Someone will watch me do it and tell me I'm doing it wrong, so I'll do it the way they show you, but then another person will see that and tell me that's the wrong way and show me the right way. So, full disclosure, I have no idea if I'm doing this right. If I plan on wearing makeup, which usually during quarantine, I've been putting on makeup and getting dressed because it makes me feel much more productive and if I plan on wearing makeup, I will use the Glossier Priming Moisturizer. So, I have to get my wisdom teeth removed in a couple months. We haven't set up the consultation yet, but it'll probably be in like June, July, probably like the end of June-ish. But I have to get my wisdom teeth removed. So do you guys want like, um, what are they called? Do you guys want a wisdom teeth removal video? Ruth already said she wants to come with me so, you know, she can make fun of me after I wake up from the anesthetics which means I can give the camera to her to vlog it. So, if you guys want a wisdom tooth removal video where I'm like all loopy on anesthetics, please let me know because I do kind of want to film it. Also, I can get my permit next month so be prepared for a drive with me. I'm so excited. Please tell me I am not the only one that is like physically incapable of putting on mascara without getting it on my eyelid because I still need to do school but it is literally 11 a.m. Yeah, it's 11 in the morning and I still have not eaten anything yet. So we're gonna go grab a late breakfast brunch first. I didn't really feel like cooking cooking, I guess, for breakfast. Maybe kind of lunch because it's 11.20. So I just have a naked smoothie and then I made some rice and eggs. <clears throat> All right, you guys, it is 11.40, which is a lot later than I usually start doing my work. I usually start at like 11 o'clock. But that's okay. I just made my homework schedule for this week and I'm probably going to spend like the next two, three hours doing schoolwork. So I will see you guys after that. All of this, I'm sorry for my horrible handwriting. All of this is one problem. One problem and it took me an hour. So... We need an ice cream break. I just finished all my schoolwork for today. I try to divide and make a schedule at the beginning of the week so that I'm not spending all day doing work and just kind of evenly distribute it amongst all five days of the week. But my hair is dry and this is the first time I haven't had it wavy in maybe a week and a half. I've been braiding my hair before I go to sleep so that it's all nice and wavy in the morning because I prefer that as to when my hair is just straight. But since it's straight today and I'm not really feeling this not wavy, not straight hair, I'm going to go ahead and wave, curl, crimp. I guess technically it's crimping my hair. And I use the Bedhead Wave Artist. My aunt gave this to me. And I'm just going to kind of loosely curl my hair and watch some YouTube while I do it. You guys i just finished crimping is that the right word is crimping even the right word i don't know but i just finished crimping my hair and i think i don't know i like the way it turned out but now i'm going to go practice the piano i've been trying to learn the avengers theme song and it is so hard i said this in my morning routine and i forgot to show you guys so i will show you guys how far i've gotten right now lighting is really bad in this room 
wait, no, we can't start yet. I'll be right back. I am Schmackman America. If you have a knockoff Captain America onesie, it's the only thing you can wear while playing the Avengers theme song. <laughs> It's definitely not perfect yet because this is so freaking hard and I'm not even at the right tempo but I just can't go that fast yet. It's really hard so I definitely need to practice but I will link the, I believe the original version in the description. It's been a little bit since I talked to you. I think it's been like, I don't even know, maybe two hours since I talked to you guys and I've literally just been sitting here for the last two hours doing this puzzle. My aunt is letting me borrow this puzzle. It is this Avengers one. It's an Infinity War one. I started it yesterday. So this is what we've accomplished. I've got most of basically like the whole Infinity War thing, except for the freaking W, which I cannot find. And it's really annoying me. And then this, I did a lot of the top, but it took forever. And I really want to keep working on this, but I have chores I need to do. So I'm going to do my chores and then I will talk to you guys again because I don't think anyone wants to watch me do dishes and clean the bathroom. Please ignore my really horrible messy bun. It It is what it is. It's fine. Um, since I last talked to you guys, I did my chores and then I just worked on the puzzle for the rest of the night. But I'm getting ready to go to sleep and stuff and I figured I would show you my nighttime skincare routine. I will, if I'm wearing makeup, I will use the simple micellar cleansing water on a little cotton pad. Just on a little cotton pad here with my makeup. But I ran out of cotton pads and I had these like Costco brand face wipes so I'm gonna use this but still put some makeup remover on it or micellar water on it because I feel like that helps get the makeup off. I don't wear that much makeup so this doesn't take too long. After I take off my makeup I will wash my face with the Curology cleanser that did not want to come off my goodness. I will wash my face with the Curology cleanser and at this point in the night I have on no makeup and then I have a ton of stuff on my face so I feel like I definitely don't look my best but that's okay. After I do that I will go in with the Curology Super Bottle and Moisturizer. This video is not sponsored. I wish it was. Curology, if you want to sponsor me, please do. I love your products. We'll go in with a pump or two of the super bottle and we, I feel like everyone knows what this is, but if you don't, it's like a custom treatment. Alright, so I will do a face mask. I'm not doing one tonight though and it's usually just a sheet mask or, I don't know, I had a couple clay masks that I really like and I have this um, first aid beauty one that I really like, but I don't feel like doing one tonight so I'm not going to. I'll do one maybe every one, one or two weeks. I'll do the moisturizer. I will roll my face with a jade roller because I have super duper duper puffy under eyes. Again, I feel like, I don't know, I probably don't have the best skincare routine and I'm probably doing a lot wrong, but I'm trying my best here. And I also didn't want to make it its own video because I feel like my routine is fairly simple. Do I do that? I feel like my routine is pretty short. I will use the Mario Badescu drying lotion and I just use a little q-tip and I get I break out pretty easily I feel like especially because I just hold on oh it looks so weird ah I just waxed my face the other day and sometimes I break out from the wax strips not all the time so I will put this on literally any problem area I see which half the time is like a third of my face. <laughs> a lot of acne, 
like I get super red it just in between my eyebrows so I kind of just like slap a whole bunch on there after I put this on the last thing I will do is put on some lip balm and I use the Glossier Balm.com mint is my favorite flavor I freaking love this stuff I'm kind of just addicted to Glossier in general just put some of that on and that is it that's all I do for my skincare routine I'll do a pore strip every once in a while if I feel like my nose is just getting to the point. Oh no, don't fall over, don't fall over. Um, sorry, I almost knocked over all my makeup brushes. That's basically it for my skincare routine. This is all I do at night. Like I said, sometimes I'll do a face mask just every once in a while whenever I'm feeling fancy and literally maybe like once a month I will do a pore strip. I try not to do them too often because I've heard they're not the best for your skin but sometimes I just look at my nose and I can't handle it anymore so I do a pore strip. I did one the other day and it felt really really nice. That is it for my skincare routine and for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did give it a thumbs up, comment down below what kind of videos you want to see next and until next time. Bye guys!